someone like Trevor getting his first big league win. You know, that's got to be exciting for you to even close that one out. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we've had a couple of those this year, and, I mean, it's fun for the guys to kind of, you know, give them their little introduction after their first win. So, you know, he threw really well after those first two hitters. It was a little shaky, obviously, and then he kind of just locked it in, which, I mean, I think he's done over the course of this year. He's, you know, started a little shaky, and then he seems to lock it in and just cruise. So it was good to get him his first one. See from, from the guys in, in, out of the pen as well. I mean, the two couple really crisp games, you know, not a lot of offense, but timely hits and then the pitching. Yeah, I mean, I think he's just coming in and attacking. I think we sat down as a, a bullpen in Arizona, and we're like, we just got to attack and get back to what we were doing at the beginning of the season. You know, remember what makes us successful and remember that, you know, we belong here. You're kind of in a different place now. How does it all, all seem to be coming together with Conley? And yeah, I mean, it seems like everyone's taking it in stride. You know, as we can see the last couple nights, you know, guys are falling in and guys are coming in in good situations and attacking hitters and, you know, letting the defense work. I mean, the Marlins, with the Marlins last couple of years, you talk about how good our defense has been, and you just kind of realize that when you get like, you see the ball get put in play, like that Miggy, that Miggy play last night for me, it's, you know, you can make them put the ball in play and good things will happen because you got such good defenders behind you. Yeah, what's it like, you know, when, in the ninth inning when you've got like four short stops basically in your infield? It makes you a lot more comfortable throwing the ball in the zone, you know, and put it in play, and even if they do hit it hard, you still got a chance at a guy either hitting it right at him or a guy like Miggy or, you know, all those guys can, can, out there running around diving after balls and not, the same thing with all the outfielders. I mean, it's nice to have, you know, seven guys behind you that, you know, can all make great plays.